Hey everybody, how's it going? Jamie Wagner here again. Uh, I'm going to do a test on the ambient light sensor in the Google Nexus 7 2013 second generation tablet. I'm running Android 4.3 on it. Everything's up to date and it's Google's latest 7 inch tablet. Um, I'm basically going to go into settings and show you how to enable the auto feature for your brightness. That way you can do this test. So really all you need to do is have a flashlight and know where to shine the flashlight into the sensor which I'll show you. So go into settings, come down and find display, select display and then you're gonna be at the top you're gonna uh, select brightness and you'll get a little pop up here. Now you can turn it on or off and I'm selecting right above the word auto there. Um, you gotta kind of do it quick because this that pop-up will disappear. One thing you can do is manually turn your brightness all the way up by using that slider. Um, to do this test, it doesn't matter where this slider is at. What matters is um, you can have it all the way up, all the way down. We can turn it all the way up. What matters is, is that you select auto. So you want to choose auto, make sure auto is selected. Now once, once you select auto, just take your flashlight um, and what you want to do is know where your camera's at on the, on the tablet. My camera, you know, I have it in the direction of the cameras on the left for mine. So, I mean, your tablet may be spun around the other way. Just make sure you find the, find the sensor. It's above the camera right there. So shine it right, basically you're going to shine it right in the camera but you're going to see the screen see how it's increasing in uh, brightness so just you know hold it there a minute and then turn the light out again as you can see shine the light there you can see the two little round circles the ones the camera the one above it is the sensor so that's where the sensor is so what you do is just sit and wait and it should decrease because it's going to adjust to the light in the room, which is dark. It has to be completely dark and then you'll see it start decreasing. There it goes. It's dropping down. I've noticed uh, I did the test earlier and it, it does take a little bit for it to drop down. Um, it, it, it's not real fast to adjust to the dark room, but once you, you know, if you shine this light in there, it'll increase really quick and get and get bright real quick. So um, that's pretty much it. Um, you know, if you sit and watch, it'll it'll slowly keep decreasing. What I'm going to do is shine shine the light in there again and get it to get bright again. So again, shine the light right in there. I mean, this kind of, you know, gives you an idea that the, the ambient light sensor is detecting um, surrounding light in the room. So there it's bright again. And if you turn out your light and sit back, it'll uh, decrease, slowly decreases back down. I'm not sure how good this is going to look on the video. I'm sure it won't be too bad. You'll probably be able to, you know, you can see what I'm doing. You have an idea what to do. So it's better if you try this at home on your own tablet. You'll be able to see how much, how much different, how much difference it is um, with the light increasing and decreasing. So... Again, that's pretty much it. You know, you just go into your settings, um, go to your display, go to brightness, make sure you turn auto on or off. There, it dropped all the way back down. And uh, I think that's about it for it. It's probably going to stay right there. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Go ahead and try. Try testing out your uh, ambient light sensor. Thanks for watching.